spy tools are now a thing of the past because even within Facebook itself, you can already start spying on any active advertisements that pages are running. And this has been the case since 2018, where Facebook, in an act of trying to be more transparent, and of course to adjust with their privacy act, they start to allow anyone with a curious mind, and provided you know where to look at, to start viewing active advertisements that are being run by that page. So at this point, I've just opened up two particular examples, and I want to show you how you can spy on any Facebook pages that might or might not be running any advertisements. So for the purpose of this particular example, I want to show you Gary Vaynerchuk's FB page. And yes, he's the, uh, one of the top social media uh, advocators and moguls. And in every Facebook page that you check out, right, you can always go to this part called the page transparency. And by the way, you can also view this in mobile, all right? You want to check out the page transparency, click on see more. And again, I'm not saying that what I'm teaching you is a very rocket science kind of thing. If you know where to look for this kind of information, it's pretty much right there, okay? And what we're seeing here right now is that you want to pay attention to this at the bottom, ads from this page. And ironically, this page is not currently running any advertisements. So with that said, when you see Facebook pages that are not running any active advertisements at all, this is what's going to show. It's not running any active ads, okay? So let's go check out another example. This is by a renowned internet entrepreneur, Frank Kern. And let's take a look at page transparency again. And you can see that this page is currently running ads. So if you want to take a look at what kind of advertisements that uh, this page is running at the present time, we'll click on go to ad library. And we'll take a look at the advertisements that are being run by the page, but normally the filter would be by your country. So here's the thing, like for example, I'm viewing this from Malaysia right now and he's not running any active advertisements here. So what you wanna do is you wanna click on perhaps filter by all countries so we can take a look at the advertisements that he is running or this page is running, okay? Or you can even filter by specific countries like United States and let's have a look. So we know that these are the advertisements that are running to the United States in particular, okay? And again, if you want to go filter, you can check out all. So once again, what I'm sharing with you here, to be very frank, it's not rocket science. Uh, again, if you know where to look at, this is pretty much the place where you can see the advertisements that are being run by a page. And this is useful in a sense that if you are going to be an agency and you're planning to run advertisements for your clients, you can spy on their competitors to see whether they are running any advertisements or if they are running any, at least get a sort of measure up what kind of competition you're up against. Now, this does not mean that it's a license for you to copy what other people are doing. And at the same time, just know that your competitors or any other Facebook marketer that know what they're doing, they can pretty much spy on your advertisements just as well. But again, this should not concern you or worry you because in the grand scheme of things, who you really want to impress or who you really want to get are your target customers or your target clients. And most of the time, uh, given the niche, they're not going to be aware of what I'm sharing you despite the obvious, unless you're obviously marketing to an internet marketing savvy crowd, then that would be a different story altogether. However, that shouldn't be of concern. Now, what's the use of spying on Facebook uh, ads that are being run by pages like this. I just want to say that it's a good fact finding. It's good for you to model after what is working or what rather what is not working and avoid them. And uh, at least you get a, have a good idea what kind of competition you are up against. All right. So as you can see, it's a very simple uh, tool and you don't have to buy any third party tools like the old days uh, anymore. It's pretty much right here. In fact, you can just go to facebook.com forward slash ads forward slash library and you can pretty much check out any other uh, Facebook page. Let's just say for the fun of it, let's go to Star Wars, okay? Yeah, this is the official Star Wars, and uh, let's see if they're running any advertisements, and yes, they do, okay? So you can see what kind of advertisements they're running, and if you, if you take a look, you can see what platforms they're running on as well. Like this is on Instagram uh, exclusively, this is on Facebook exclusively, and there we go.